Growing up on a 160-acre farm in Bryan set the tone for a successful career for the 2013 College of Business and Innovation's Outstanding Alumnus. Gary Smith learned early on that hard work goes a long way. He also learned a few other things. The second of four children learned that it's not a lot of fun milking cows at five in the morning when it's zero outside. Gary's business career started right after his graduation from Fairview High School in 1963 when he talked his dad into taking out a loan to buy one of 10 independent Pepsi distributorships in the area that had come up for sale. Gary paid off the note in seven months. While peddling Pepsi, Gary sold himself to the girl who would become his wife of 45 years, Linda. To this day, his bride tells everyone that Gary dated all of her friends before he asked her out. Soon Uncle Sam came calling with a new product in several new locations. Gary began a two-year stint that saw him earn the rank of corporal while traveling to three states before landing back in Toledo at the Federal Building. An electrical repairman, Gary was called into his superior's office and told, you don't belong here, get your backside to UT and I'll work with you on your schedule. With that, the soon-to-be father of two kids was on his way to completing a bachelor's in accounting in 1972. It didn't take Gary long to become a big fish in business. He spent six years with Arthur Young before being tabbed to serve as vice president and controller of Toledo Pickling and Steel Service. Gary then became a big shooter at the Andersons. From 1980 until his retirement in 2010 as vice president of finance and treasurer, Gary played a huge role in growing the firm into a major player in agriculture, rail car leasing and repair, turf products and general merchandise retailing. In 1996, he led the team that took Andersons from a private partnership to a corporation on NASDAQ and led the sale of additional shares of the company in 2004. Those moves led to acquisitions and diversification. At the time of his retirement, Anderson's sales exceeded $4 billion annually with earnings of $65 million. As his career took flight, so did requests for his talents in the volunteer and for-profit community, something that continues to this day. An attendee of the Harvard Business School Finance Program and the Stanford Business School Executive Program, Gary served 10 years on the board of the Toledo Zoological Society, including two as president. He's on the board of Mercy Health Partners, is chair of the board of Lansing Trade Group in Kansas, is on the board of GAC Chemical in Maine, the AAA Club Partners of California, as well as AAA of Northwest Ohio. For 21 years, Gary served on the board of trustees of the UT Foundation, chairing the investment committee and serving as its president. Gary is especially proud of the fact that in addition to his degree, Linda has a UT bachelor's in public health and that his physician son Jeffrey is a 1998 graduate of the College of Medicine and Life Sciences. Thanks to Jeff and his sister Stephanie, Gary now has seven grandchildren ranging in age from 6 to 19. 41 years after his graduation, Gary Smith continues to make his mark in the business community. He's the College of Business and Innovation's outstanding alumnus this year.